welcome back all you wonderful magnificent fantastic people welcome back to another really cool really awesome exciting episode of uh taming in use yeah so today we are going to be uh taking a little look see at the maywing um i i recorded this once actually and i wasn't happy with how i recorded it so i was like you know what i'm just going to do it again um Mostly because I forgot to do the baby stuff at the end. So I was like, well, I don't know. I don't want to clip it in. I'm just going to re-record it because it's really not that hard. So here we are. Um, now, there is a mailing under here, which is why we're here. Um, there it is. Right over there. None of the ones I've been finding have been high levels. Um, but anyways, it makes no difference. Now, apparently you can build a billboard trap um, and kind of block them in. I've tried that a few times and I cannot get it to work for me, so I'm not going to show that off in here. I'm just going to show off what works for me uh, because maybe it'll work for you. Um, now, with the Maywing here, because you can't put it into a damn trap, uh, I even tried luring it with honey. didn't work. Um, I didn't try rare flowers. That could possibly work. Um, so, the only way I found to trap these damn things is with the harpoon launcher here and a net projectile. So, what we're going to do is, uh, we're going to swim down here. Now, I haven't tried this on underwater creatures. I don't even know if it'll shoot underwater. Um, I just know that the Maywing, oh, beautiful, uh, has no oxygen stat. So, you can, in fact, do this underwater, which is extremely handy. We're just going to come over here. Trank dart to the head. Uh, just go up and get a little bit of oxygen quickly. There we go. We don't want to drown while doing this. Alright, back down. Now, did that one put it out? Okay. Put a second one into it. There we go. Now, two trank darts and that's it. And it is out. Um, they are very, very easy to knock out. Now, this is only a level 20, but they, they really don't take much to knock out. I don't know if it's the low torpor or, uh, yeah, they, they have low, low torpor. Um, so, that's pretty much it. Oh, shit. Oh, up, 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 Don't drown yourself while doing this, folks. <laughs> okay, that's all it takes to, uh... To knock out the Maywings, they are very, very easy. Um, once this guy is done taming up here. That's the other handy thing. Uh, they also eat everything. You can give these guys berries, you can give them meat, you can give them kibble, you can give them whatever you want. Um, as you can see, this guy is taming up really well. There we go. Okay, we're just going to name you after. We're just going to get out of the water. And I don't think I brought the saddle with me. So I will probably just clip out here and I will bring you guys back in a sec once we get back to the base. Um, I'm just going to see if it's on the Deinonychus or Deinopithecus. That's, that's the word. So many dinos. Alright. Um, no, I did not bring it. Okay, so I am going to bring you guys back in a second once uh, we get back over to the base. Alright, see you in a second. So, got back here, got the saddle, and now we're going to hop on here and I'll uh, show you guys a couple cool things. I'm just going to get down here and out the uh, door here. There we go. So, handy thing about the Maywing is if you hold your A button, you can get a cool ass glide going. Now. These things can glide for almost ever, um, and if you head on a downward spiral, downward spiral, downward, uh, there we go, you can really pick up some speed. I mean, look at us, we're all the way back here. And then, they got this cool, like, gliding thing on the water when you land on the water. I mean, if you do stop, um, they go back down to normal, but that is, like, so cool. You can, like, ski across the water. And when you sprint in water, they are very, very quick. Um, they also don't have an oxygen stat, so that is really cool. Um, also, you can jump out of the water. 
not many creatures can actually do that so that is like a really cool feature tap a again do your glide figure out where we are so we're not lost oh wow we're like the complete wrong direction there we go but yeah i love that uh there we go these things are like so cool they can really get going too um now they can't fly they do glide so you do have to keep momentum going or else you just kind of crash land like that but uh yeah honestly really really handy um and now we just got to get back to our base here because we definitely went a little bit the wrong direction we're just gonna glide our way back here like these things are so cool um We'll get back over to the base here and I will show you the other handy features about this thing. Um, this video may be a little bit longer. Oh, of course, you're gonna do that. Okay, you know what? We're just gonna do this quickly. Uh, I don't wanna drag the video out too, too long. All right, there we go. Let's get creative on. I'm just gonna fly back over here because I don't wanna wait too long. Excellent, okay. So we're going to get in here, and this is where I have a little breeding setup going. Um, and what we're going to do... Where are the eggs? Okay. Uh, we're just going to grab out two. We're going to take these and plop them in our egg incubator here. There we go. And they can start just doing their thing. So level 100 and a level 100, beautiful. Um, now, I guess I could just wait. I don't know, I don't know how long this is gonna take. I don't wanna wait, or I'll make you guys wait. Okay, so I'm gonna bring you guys back in a second and uh, I will show you the features that it does with eggs. All right, see you in a sec. All right, so got two babies going here what we're gonna do is we're gonna bring them on over here hopefully they don't get stuck on the lamp beautiful all right now the other neat thing about the may wings here is uh you can actually pick up baby dinos with them so we'll bring them over here um come on activate here so you go down and you can pick them up individually or you can pick up each one uh, or um, all of them together. So now they're just gonna sit in there and uh, she will take care of them as long as there's food inside her inventory that they will eat. So we'll put some meat in there just to make sure. And they will actually eat the meat from her inventory instead of actually going hungry. Um, extremely handy and you can still do your imprinting just like that. Oops, damn it. I didn't want to get on you. Um, you can also activate a feed trough, which is this squirting milk going on here. Uh, you come over and hold um, your Y button on Xbox or whatever it is on the other ones and enable nursing baby feeding trough. Boom, just like that. It will take care of all your babies within range. You can actually come in here and go to show trough area. Um, it'll show you how far it's going to reach. Now, you don't have to keep that on. Um, just handy if you want to make sure you know how far and if you come in here and increase your nursing effectiveness it'll actually increase the range of the trough so we'll come back in here and boom so it doesn't go up a huge amount each time but it does go up a little bit so that is uh whoops let's get back here turn that off that is basically the maywing um you can also use it to pick up baby dinos um not wild ones but um it can steal enemy baby creatures and, uh, you know, take off with them. <laughs> it's pretty neat. You can also use it to transport your babies like this uh, so that you don't have to walk around as, as slow with them because uh, that can take a very, very long time. Um, nice, I'm glad these guys just want cuddles. So it's really handy. So we can take our babies and just take them wherever we want them to be. Um, we don't have to worry about just keeping them here. And once they're full grown, she will just drop them out or he, whatever it is. It's kind of a uh, mixed sex um they will also lay random eggs that you can use for kibble now i haven't been able to get them to do that so i can show it on camera here but they also do that so hopefully you guys enjoyed the episode if you did smash that like button for me 
hit that sub button if you're new here. Tell your friends, share it around, all that cool stuff. Most importantly, hopefully you're all staying awesome, being kind to one another, being kind to yourselves. I'll see each and every one of you guys here real, real soon.